The sport and exercise science to me is the balance of health and performance and we're using the science essentially to marry um, the outcome measures we look at and how we can change those. How the body responds to exercise and sort of the science behind that. So we're training students in the scientific method but we're applying that to sport and exercise context. The course covers uh, psychology, biomechanics, physical activity and physiology. So they're the main four disciplines of sport and exercise science. We've essentially got a, a discipline strand as well as two core pillars of research skills and research methods. And the reason for that is that this is a British Association for Sport and Exercise Sciences endorsed programme. This means that the students stay multidisciplinary for two years. The students can then specialise in chosen disciplines and undertake a placement then at level six. So we have students who do placements at Everton Football Club. We also have students who do placements at, at local charities and we also have some really strong partnerships with local schools for students who are looking at going on to a career in, in teaching. So the placement I'm doing is strength and conditioning. So we're planning programmes for athletes, so whether they be individual, team based. So our rugby athletes wanted to get stronger and more powerful. So we've been using stuff like jumps to express that force quickly and it shows, I mean, the data they produce today. It puts your knowledge and learning into the practical world which helps you understand it more and get you thinking about the theory side as well as the, the, the practical actually doing it. So there's a wide range of opportunities depending on the particular uh, work experience that the student would like. So the students have got access to world leading lab facilities. So these include uh, purpose built biomechanics labs that allow us to look very accurately at forces, environmental chambers, uh, hypoxic chambers, as well as ultrasound scanning facilities. So there's a huge variety of, uh, of equipment that we have here that allows students to become trained and also expert in, in those particular devices. The equipment is also state of the art and that's across all disciplines, so whether that's physiology, biomechanics, psychology or physical activity and health. At the moment I'm really enjoying the labs, I think they're really interactive and you can learn a lot from them. The lab's incredible, especially again for sport and exercise science, really, really good. That's basically why I chose John Moore's, because of the lab facilities that they've got. It's state of the art, I mean, it was all revamped this year, so they're constantly upgrading that. It's, it blows my mind, literally. So. We've got a big uh, staffing base, so we've got over 60 full-time academic members of staff able to support the students. A number of the staff are internationally recognised for their research excellence and it's that research that they do that informs the teaching that, that they deliver. There is a lot of support because you do have a lot of good facilities and I think that sort of facilitates your learning a little bit better so it does make it more effective and obviously the lecturers are really helpful and they make sure that you do get the best out of you know, those seminars which are really good. They're always willing to offer you a helping hand no matter how big or small it is. They are world-class researchers and I think you see kind of your standard lecture but then they'll change it at the end where they're like, oh we just found this out the other day and that to me is mind-blowing because it's like you're right up to date of the course. So those staff can deliver a wide range of kind of informed experiences and can use that to, to inform their, their research and their teaching. I really love the city, it's fantastic. The people are lovely here, all the students are lovely, so welcoming, all the staff are really nice, it's, it's a really nice place to be. There's nightlife everywhere you go and I love that. If you want something scenic, you've got the docks as well. I just think the people in general are lovely and friendly, so I personally feel at home here.